Good morning, everyone. As I mentioned earlier, you know, what I feel like is the most important part of my week is what we do around this table and, and remembrance of him. And You know, you look at the, the signs that we have on the walls, and, and this morning I'm going to be talking about the bread of life. I'm going to be talking about, uh, talking about food, talking about uh, what we all like to do and what we all... Uh, uh, think about quite often where we're getting where we're getting our next meal and you know after Jesus fed the fed the 5,000 they were following him because he was feeding them and and uh, they were just uh, going going to try to find him to even get more food I think and then uh, after they found him on the other side of the lake they asked him rabbi uh, when did you get here and Jesus answered I tell you the truth you're not looking for me not just because you saw miraculous signs, but because you ate the loaves and had your fill. And then he said, do not work for food that spoils, but for food that endures to eternal life. And uh, later on in verse 35, Jesus declared, I am the bread of life. He who comes to me will never go hungry, and he who believes in me will never be thirsty. But as I told you, you have seen, you have seen me, and still you do not believe. All that the Father gives me will come to me, and whoever comes to me will never drive, I will never drive away. For I have come down from heaven, not to do my will, but to do the will of him who sent me. Let's give thanks. Thanks. 